California is recognized for its beautiful beaches, fascinating metropolitan cities like Los Angeles and San Francisco, and fantastic amusement parks. California, on the other hand, is home to a plethora of unique and attractive tiny towns. Many of these hidden treasures are popular vacation spots for California residents. Want to see what the locals have discovered that the rest of the world has yet to discover? Then you'll want to visit some of California's attractive tiny towns for yourself. Number 1. Pacific Grove Thousands of tiny monarch butterflies flutter into Pacific Grove to spend the winter between mid-October and mid-February, making it one of the most attractive beach towns between Monterey and Pebble Beach. The moderate environment of Pacific Grove is one of the factors that attracts these butterflies. The pleasant weather, as well as the town's lovely coastline backdrop and elegant Victorian mansions are all popular draws for human visitors. If you're planning a trip to Pacific Grove, make sure to leave time for the Monterey Bay Aquarium. It is one of the top aquariums in the country and is located on the boundary between Pacific Grove and Monterey. Number 2. Avalon Avalon on Santa Catalina Island is only a one-hour boat ride or a 15-minute helicopter ride away from Los Angeles. However, this quaint tiny town feels like it's on another continent from bustling Los Angeles. For starters, because there are just a few cars permitted on the island, tourists usually get around by walking, riding a bike, taking the public bus or trolley, or renting a golf cart. The town's vibe is also fairly low-key and laid-back. Snorkeling, hiking, glass-bottom boat trips, and shopping on Avalon Short Main Street are all popular pastimes. Number 3. Solving If you happened into solving by chance, you may think you'd taken a wrong turn and ended up in a Danish village. And you'd be half correct. Despite its location in California's Santa Ana's Valley, this small hamlet was founded by a group of Danes in 1911. So don't be surprised if you see a few windmills strewn around town or if the buildings in Salving have traditional Danish farm-style facades. If you're visiting Salving, make sure to sample real Danish pastries and look for unusual souvenirs like miniature wooden shoes or china windmills. Number 4. Sausalito Sausalito has a unique vibe that is a blend of contemporary, laid-back beachy, and creative. Sausalito is home to the largest local artist cooperative in the San Francisco Bay Area as well as excellent shopping and a variety of outdoor dining options. Even though it is only a short distance away, Sausalito has a wonderful little beach and notably warmer weather than San Francisco. To get to Sausalito from San Francisco, either drive over the Golden Gate Bridge or take the boat for a more beautiful option. Number 5. Healdsburg Healdsburg, in the heart of Sonoma County's wine country, will entice you with its laid-back atmosphere and small-town charm. It's also recognized for its fresh, farm-to-table culinary restaurants, art galleries, and attractive boutiques. Of course, while you're in Healdsburg, you'll want to visit one of the more than 100 wineries and tasting rooms in the area. Camping and hot air ballooning are popular activities for nature lovers. If you're a cyclist who also enjoys wine, the 30-mile sip and cycle route, which includes stops at wonderful wineries and zips through beautiful countryside, is a must-try. Who needs Tuscany, really? Number 6. Mendocino Mendocino, about three and a half hours north of San Francisco, is a great place to visit if you're looking for a relaxing, beautiful break. Mendocino is perched on a hill above the Pacific Ocean, in an area known for its dramatic, craggy coast. It is an artist community where you can see works by local artists and galleries and businesses. Mendocino is also known for being a great place to visit for romantic vacations and outdoor activities like biking and hiking. Number 7. Julian Julian is a historic California gold rush town located in the Kaimaka Mountains, just a few hours south of San Diego. This small town retains the spirit of the Old West thanks to its ancient old buildings. There's even a mine nearby where you can take a tour or try your hand at gold panning. Julian's Pick Your Own Apple Orchards draw a large number of visitors in the fall who want to go apple picking or sample pies from the locally famous Julian Apple Pie Company. Horseback riding, hiking, and boating on the neighboring Kaimaka Lake are some of the other things to do in Julian. Number 8. Borrego Springs Borrego Springs is a one-of-a-kind desert community. For starters, it is California's only community wholly within a state park and a Borrego Desert State Park, to be precise. It's also an official international dark sky community, so it's a great sight to see the glittering stars at night. Also, don't be shocked if you come upon a dinosaur or other weird creature while traveling through the Gallatin Meadows in Borrego Springs. 
130 big metal sculptures are strewn across the roads in this area. Borrego Springs is such a fascinating hamlet that it was named one of America's coolest desert towns by travel and leisure. Borrego Springs, which is located in San Diego County, is also a renowned winter resort for snowbirds. Number 9. Carmel by the Sea Carmel by the Sea is one of California's most beautiful small towns, which is high praise given the state's plenty of candidates. This charming tiny community has European-style houses and is situated on a beautiful white sand beach. It has long been a favorite place for romantic getaways and artists due to its beauty and charm. While visiting Carmel by the Sea, be sure to take a drive down the neighboring 17-mile drive, which is known for its breathtaking vistas of the craggy coastline and pounding Pacific Ocean waves. Number 10. Ajay This picturesque and serene little town located in Ventura County approximately an hour and a half drive from Los Angeles. Has long been a favorite weekend destination for Los Angeles residents seeking a break that will refresh them both physically and psychologically. Hiking the area's more than 20 pathways, biking, and shopping at Ajay's boutiques and galleries are all popular activities. Most visitors' lists typically include a visit to a local spa for some pampering. Are you on the lookout for something a little more spiritual? then you should pay a visit to Meditation Mount, a public meditation center. Number 11. Nevada City Thousands of settlers flocked to California shortly after gold was discovered in the state in 1848. Nevada City, about 60 miles, 100 kilometers northeast of Sacramento, was one of the settlements that grew up at that time. Nevada City, founded in 1849, grew to become one of California's wealthiest mining communities. Gambling parlors, hotels, and, of course, saloons line the streets. The 1865 Nevada Theater, which is California's oldest running theater construction on the West Coast, is one of the old buildings that still exist. Nevada City's lovely historic quarter still appears like it belongs in a Wild West movie. Number 12. St. Helena St. Helena is located in the heart of Napa Valley, giving it an ideal starting place for seeing the region's many fantastic wineries. Because exquisite wines go so well with delicious food, this quaint town also has a plethora of excellent eateries. Of course, you'll need a means to burn off all of the calories you will undoubtedly consume while in the Napa Valley. And one of the most popular ways to do it is by cycling about the area. You're not a biker. Then there's always pampering yourself at one of St. Helena's many spas or visiting one of the city's many art galleries.